Hey everyone, Muckle at Douglas Bartholomew Reginald Esquire the Fourth here, and I'll get right to the point. We have a solution for an issue that has been plaguing Twitch content creators for years. Here's how it works. On Twitch, if you download a clip or highlight, it will end up looking like this. But now, we have a fix for that. For some reason, Twitch doesn't keep the name of the clip or highlight as the file name of downloaded items. So if you download a ton of items, then you have to rewatch and rename them all to get them organized. Something that gets more annoying the more things that you download. A member of our community heard me ranting about this one day and made a small program that can tackle this issue. I will show you how it works, then give instructions on how to set it up if you would like to use it yourself. All we need to do is download a few items from Twitch. I'm just going to grab a few small clips right here. They go into your downloads folder. I'm going to copy them to another specific folder that I'll show you soon. I open up the Twitch vid converter tool that was made by our community, click convert and done. Their file names are fixed to what they should have been. And then I can move them out of that folder, put them in YouTube videos, whatever, and move on. For many of us content creators, this is a dream come true that will save so much time. Here is how to get this thing set up. Step one, you're gonna go to this URL. I will have a link to this in the description below the video if you want to just copy paste it. Click install right here to download and install the program. I'm gonna pause here really quick. I am not a programmer. However, I did ask numerous other programmers I know and trust to look over the code and make sure that everything here was on the up and up. Every one of them said that it is a very small program with not much to look over, no places for anything to hide, and said it was completely clean. That said, if you have any concerns, please feel free to talk to us in the Tech Talk channel of our Discord, and we would be happy to address them. Now, if you want to continue, after you have installed the program, you can run it just by going to Start and then Twitch Vid Converter. If there are any updates, it will ask you if it is okay to install those when you open it up. You may have to hit Run anyway or give it permission depending on your security settings. Once the program is launched for the first time, you will get this little box. The drop-down menu up here at the top simply changes the view. Use whichever one you like. Now we need to make a folder that has nothing in it. I made one called prep on my C drive, but you can put it anywhere. Copy the path for the folder you made into the Twitch vid converter. You are now ready to go. To use the tool, we're going to copy any downloaded clips or highlights with bad file names into this folder and then click convert. It should work on up to 100 files at a time. Once files have their names fixed, move them out of the folder. The tool will not function if there are items in this folder that don't need fixing. And that is all there is to it. A huge thank you again to Link in our community who whipped this program up and the other nerds in our tech channel who helped refine it. This is going to save a lot of working hours in the future for us content creators. If you have any problems with the utility or any questions, please direct them to our Discord. There's a link in the description and into the Tech Talk channel. Thanks for watching and I hope this helps someone else as much as it helped me.